Welcome back, and we are back with more choices for you tonight. Next up, me. I'm looking to relax on a rooftop terrace, but which one? Hi everyone, I'm soaking in all this sun while we have it. What better way than hanging out on a rooftop with a delicious drink and a bite to eat? I could relax and take in Boston skyline at Yotel's Deck 12. Or I can join the party at Cambridge's only rooftop terrace and bar, the Blue Owl. So there you have it. Boston's Yotel rooftop, Cambridge's rooftop bar, the Blue Owl. The votes are in and here we go. 40% of you are in the mood for rooftop living in Boston and 60 are curious about the only rooftop bar in Cambridge. The Blue Owl in Cambridge it is. Let's head there now. <laughs> A blue owl is perched five stories above Central Square. No, not an actual bird, a new rooftop bar with a fun vibe at the 907 Main Hotel. It's uh, an oasis. This one is the only rooftop bar really in the area. The hotel and restaurant's owner, Patrick Barrett, says the concept plays off his personality, especially the music. I'm from the late 80s, early 90s. Um, that's why I've time traveled to this moment in time uh, to bring hip hop to this area. I've uh, put together a lot of soundtracks myself. The drinks menu is composed of clever creations such as let them eat cake, cognac mixed with an apricot liqueur, honey and fresh lemon topped with burgundy bubbles. We keep trying to find different ways to utilize spirits from all over the world. A lot of tequilas and mezcals, like just anything that we can find and put our hands on to make yummy fun cocktails. Including the tequila based Kiwi Kickstarter. It's shaken with a sherry and a Galliano aperitivo, kiwi and lemon. Super tasty, has a bunch of like interesting notes. Speaking of tasty, the dishes are inspired by street food favorites from around the world, including the Korean fried chicken wings, oxtail beef patties with Caribbean slaw, and za'atar spiced crispy lamb ribs. Our food menu kind of wants to inspire you to travel around the world in its own way. We connect Kendall Square and Central Square. Patrick so Barrett going? says the food and drink make the Blue Owl special. It's the Central Square location that makes it home. We are a cultural district. We are the heart of this entire city. And this building, this project, the Blue Owl, is a love letter to Central Square. Ah, it was so fun and the drinks weren't bad either. The Blue Owl is located in a part of Central Square once known as Confectioner's Row. Patrick Bennett says Main Street was lined with candy shops in the early 1900s from the nearby candy factories. The Blue Owl's name is a nod to the Tootsie Owl. The Blue Owl is also a drink, a delightful blue blend of vermouth, bitters, rose water and lemon. Next up, it's Nicole's turn and she's ready for a feast. What should she eat, vote on our social media to decide and we will be right back.